Hey guys, what's up? Bisectatron here from One Hive Gazette, here with the next War Recap video. And this is going to be a quick one, uh, just a few attacks. Uh, but anyway, coming from the one against Russian League, um, unfortunately we're trying to get an arranged war this weekend, but we missed the matchup and got instead this clan, which was actually level 9. Um, we just reached level 9, uh, so definitely not an easy thing to do. But unfortunately, they were still kind of stuck in the two-star game, and uh, pretty much all two-stars besides the Town Hall 8s, and then their bases were mostly anti-two-star, with a few exceptions. So um, good job to One Hive Genesis. Uh, not the closest war, but still had some good attacks. I'm only going to show two of them, uh, just because I want to don't want to spend too much time in this war. Um, but anyway, looking at GWAG, taking on number three. Uh, I'm pretty sure this this is a first attack, so did not know that Lava Hound would be in there, but brought a few archers, I think, just in case it was, and instead of using four healers for the Queen Walk, uh, decided just to use three, kind of just, you know, last minute decision as the raid was going. Um, obviously, the... Um, <clears throat> Uh, sorry, obviously the healer have been nerfed a little bit since the update um, So the more healers you use the less effective they are uh, But three healers a little bit close here. You can see the Queen's very low on health uh, Drops of rage the healers just are in that radius So the healers are gonna keep the Queen up and she'll take out the defensive Queen right here uh, But the Queen got very low so uh, it Took a risk there, but it works out and the Lava Hound's out of the picture for pretty much the entire attack So it worked out um, dropping two golems here, and then I like these one hogs, just easy trades. Uh, everything's shooting at that golem, and then nothing's covering the point defense. So can just get uh, one for one for those hogs. Uh, wizards to create the funnel. The queen's going to kind of walk around and get stuck here, just because she's not going to reach the kill squad in time to enter the base. I'm not sure what the plan was for her, but uh, here come the wall breakers, just going to bust in right here. Uh, let the king in. Um, golems reroute back in there, take out the mortar in just a moment, and then has the uh, jump spell to let uh, the king into the core, take out both the enemy heroes, and uh, trigger some giant bombs. That works out nicely, and then you can see the queen's going to get stuck down here at the bottom as soon as that air defense goes down, um, so she'll be kind of be out of the picture for a while, but the king will be enough to get the job done. Everything's shooting at those golems right now, so that works out and uh, both the king and the queen are going to go down. Comes in with the hogs here at the top, uh, just two finger drops them in pretty much with a heal, a few more in the bag, we'll deploy in just a moment, um, right in that wizard tower, and then has one more heal for them. Uh, almost missed the king's ability, just got it off in time, but still pretty late and the king dies pretty quickly, but uh, at least gets the barbarian spawned, which was okay, and then doesn't even need that last heal spell. Queen steps up, she made her through the, made her way through that wall, so she'll shoot down the last defense, and now it's just clean up. Uh, didn't even need those poison spells because the Hound was taken out of the raid, and didn't even need that heal spell, so nice attack. Uh, hound busts the last second, but too little too late. Um, nice job to G-Wag. Um, take a look at my attack, actually, just wanted to show it. It was kind of neat. Um, using some of the Golem mechanics, so I'm going to drop these golems super wide and then have them kind of walk up to the top here. So the plan is on the left side to have those wizards step up and shoot down uh, the cannon and the archer tower right there. Then on the right side to have my queen kind of do a queen walk and shoot down the cannon and the archer tower on that side. So kind of just get everything, the, the golems to reroute back up to the top and to enter the base up there with my Valks. Um, the queen shot down a few of my wizards but still got the job done. You can see the golem on the left uh, has starting to walk up towards the top, and then on the right here, the golem's making its way up also. Uh, in my CC, I have a few giants, uh, wizards, and I'm going to drop some of my Valks, so everything kind of making its way into the top here. Uh, and I can, you can see, uh, with the update, uh, you can now bring the four earthquakes and then three heal spells, so it allows you to really mix it up. And obviously don't have a poison for the CC, so I'm going to have my wizards, the queen, shoot it down. Um, and they'll get, they'll do some damage to my kill score, but it's definitely worth it having that third heal spell now, even when you bring the quakes. So works out nicely here. Um, everything's kind of making its way through the base. Earthquakes open up, you know, three quarters of the base right there. All those compartments are open to the Valks and the king, queen. Um, coming in with the hogs here on the bottom. 
can drop my first heal uh, or my last heal, I guess, just one heal for the hogs uh, right there. And <clears throat> uh, the hogs will make their way through. So actually, I, I used a jump spell, so only had two heals, one for the kill squad, one for the hogs. And that one giant bomb goes off, and the, ho the hogs are out of the heal by then. So uh, don't get quite the benefit of that heal as much as I would have wanted to, but the all the defenses are down, and that's going to do it for this one. Fast forward for cleanup, um, but yeah, two Town Hall 9 attacks is all I'm going to show this war. I'm still working on some things, so pretty busy with the channel. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoy the attacks. Uh, like I said, nothing's really changing too much in the channel. Besides the channel art, just kind of getting a different look to it. Uh, so hope you enjoy this, um, but that's going to do it. First war recap from One Hive Gazette. Uh, doesn't look too much different, I hope. So hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys later. Bye, Sectatron out.